Here we have 5.2 multiplying rational expressions involving quadratics with leading coefficient of 1. So here we're going to be doing the same thing as we do with reducing fractions. The only issue is that here the, um, the numerators and the denominators are not already factored. So I do have to factor them. So I'm going to write it as one giant fraction because when you multiply, you just multiply the tops together and then the bottoms together. So I'm going to have x minus 3 multiplied by this, but I'm actually going to factor that. It's 3 times x plus 3. And then this bottom, which I'm going to factor, is x and x um, plus 3 and minus 2 and then times this denominator, which I cannot factor. So I'm going to just put it in parentheses because it's going to be multiplied, right? That entire numerator has to get multiplied, which is why I put the parentheses. This entire denominator needs to be multiplied by that one, which is why I put it in parentheses. Um, then from there, you're just going to reduce. So I noticed that I have an x plus 3 factor the same here and here and so those are going to reduce and what am I left with at the bottom I'm left with x minus 2 and x minus 1 at the top I'm left with these two factors but we know typically when we factor out GCFs we always like that um, coefficient to be in the front we don't usually ever leave it in the back so it's just a matter of rewriting or rearranging that product in the numerator but this is the final answer since I cannot reduce any more of these. These factors are not the same. Okay. Um, so then that is the end of our topic. All of them are going to work that way. Of course, each numerator and denominator must be factored. And um, once they are factored, what they have in common may be different. It may not necessarily have been a factor from here and a factor from there. Could have been one from here, one from there. The key point is that it has to be one top factor that reduces with one bottom factor. That's the main idea. One top factor with one bottom factor.